My name is Gloria Cheche. I'm from Tanzania, and for those who don't know, it's in East Africa. I used to work in development and uh, specifically in the environment when I was back home in Tanzania. And while I was there, I was working with an NGO, but I decided to expand from the, the project-based and NGO work into multilateral and evaluation work, just because if you're working on projects, you really don't know how much impact they actually do have. So this was an opportunity for me to get a more broader, wider perspective of the kind of work that we're doing in those countries. And so I applied to Jeff while I was at IDS, and I'm loving it so far. I would say there'd be two things that I did find a little challenging. Uh, one would be, first of all, just how much work you have to put into the reviews. So on one, on one hand, you expect that the evaluations would be done for you, and then you'd come in and just do the analysis. But then there's just so much you actually have to think through the evaluations of the evaluations. So that was a, a little bit challenging. And on the second thing would be just having that big perspective view is a lot, a lot more difficult than you think it would be, uh, just because you have to an analyze things on a very different level uh, from what I was used to working from projects. I learned a lot in terms of evaluation. So I hadn't done uh, so much of the big perspective evaluation in the past. And I did learn a lot in terms of uh, the quality of evaluation, the depth of evaluation, and getting the global, uh, global perspective, just seeing things uh, the way that different um, projects are worked from region to region. The skills that I did gain would be in terms of uh, um, analyzing the theory of change, uh, looking at how things, um, kind of looking at the scope of projects over uh, the long term. That is one of the really big things that I did gain inter uh, professionally. Um, uh, working with uh, such, a, uh, such an important office as the Jeff itself, I would say you gain a, a lot of the experience through the World Bank and uh, the kind of understanding that you get, the kind of uh, people that you get to meet with, uh, the kind of connections that you can make. It's a really big thing. I would say you should try to meet with as many people as you can, uh, just because at the GF you just have, you, you might be working with one specific team, but you just have so much knowledge across the other teams and uh, across the other uh, parts of the GF office and the evaluation office itself. I would also say that you should not just look at the kind of projects that you're assigned, but try to get a much bigger picture of what GF is trying to do and uh, the kind of impact that it is trying to make. Uh, just because you would, the, the, the kind of experience that you get here and the kind of exposure that you do have is very unique. So you should try to take advantage of it as much as possible. For people who are applying, I would say that you should, uh, first of all, uh, think about what kind of experience that you do want. So when you're trying to pick between the different teams that you do, uh, that you can apply to, uh, across the performance team, across the impact team, if you are specifically applying for the impact team, I would say you should think about what is the broader picture that you're trying to look at, and what is the what the kind of analysis that you would like to do, and. At the same time, when you're thinking about that, you should try to uh, portray as much of the experience that you do have in terms of uh, impact evaluation, but also try to bring in as much of the uh, project experience that you do have if you are coming from a project base.